And we are about to say goodbye to 2020, and plenty of people are sure to celebrate what many are calling the worst year in history. But those celebrations, as they begin, we want to make sure that everybody remains safe so it's not a bad ending to the year as well. Team 12's Matt Uris joins us now live from Scottsdale with some more important reminders. Hey, Matt. Ryan, I chuckle because as all things 2020, it's not quite going right out here. Right as you're tossing to me, the script on my phone is going black. But yes, you said it, officially saying goodbye to 2020. Because of COVID-19, more people are being told to and likely expected to stay home this year than ever. So if you're looking to bring in 2021 with a bang, we want to make sure you do it safely. We've got a couple of tips here from the Scottsdale Fire Department. Let's take a look at those now. Fireworks are allowed until January 3rd. So if you don't get it out of your system on New Year's Eve, you got a few more nights to, uh, to do so. But when you go to light them, make sure you are not near any desert areas. And under no circumstances can you set them off on publicly owned property. Finally, don't shoot guns into the air. After all, what goes up must come down. Not trying to be a party pooper here. Rather, make sure everyone has a happy and healthy start to the new year. According to the Fire Prevention Association, on New Year's Eve, there are about 19,500 fires reported, 9,000 injuries, 36% of whom are kids. And lastly, and certainly not least here, remember, experts are encouraging everyone to stay home, social distance if you are going to go out, uh, and of course, wear your mask um, wherever you head out into public. So again, really focusing on making sure 2020 is behind us, and 2021 starts in a new, safe way. Live in Scottsdale, Matt Yuris, Today in AZ.